So, I stopped going to the gym. And there's a very good reason for this. The gym was always a place where I could go, chill out, learn new moves. Sometimes I wouldn't even go and learn new moves. I would just go there and chill with my friends. That was like the gym. It's like a very cool indoor flipping session. That's my type of chill. Later, the gym changed. When I started doing this free running thing, it was it was easy, right? For me, it was all about learning. I got into it so I got so passionate about it. I started with parkour and I went over to some free running, started adding some flips to it and all that. But now here's the thing, right? I'm not into it as much right now. And like whatever I want to do, I go in for it fully. So here's here's what happened. The guys in the gym, not all of them, more the beginners, right? Going about simple stuff. When I see the moves, like it's not all that impressive, right? It kind of takes me off a little bit. The thing is, I like my friends, right? I like my friends and it took a while to find the right type of friends. Because believe me, there are a lot of people that do what we do in this country. It's not like I just picked some random guys, the only guys who do this and then start to hang with them. No, there are actually a bunch of guys that do this. And I'm not referring to Adam. Adam's still cool, but Adam does parkour. It's just a different kind of thing. We waited a while before we started our alternate group because we have to get the right people, right? I always have this thing about when you're starting to resent your friends, you have to speak out, you have to take action, or you have you have to do something to change that, especially if it's someone that you really care about, that you hang out with a lot. And when I get that little hint of resenting my friends, starting to like kind of like, oh, I don't want to be around him. See, that's that's what messes me up. I'm like, no, I don't want that. I don't want that at all. That's bad for me. I mean, I like my friends, so. I can't hate my friends, right? And that's when I decided, you know what, this 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 gym is probably not a good thing for me because the guys going about simple stuff, it's 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 not great for me, right? Well, that's one reason I don't go to the gym. It's because of all the stigma. Mm, no, I don't want that. I don't want that anymore because it's not anymore a chill spot. It's more of a thing of showcase your skills. So I stopped going to the gym for because of that. Another reason is because I forgot why I started doing this, right? I stopped doing what I love because in the gym it's kind of a thing about oh somebody does this thing let me also try that I want to do that for a while you know I haven't been chasing it as a passion anymore so it's like I just try to do what others do and that's not me right but there is that little bit of me that always wants to be the best no matter what whatever I do I always try to be the best at it or be the best me that I can be right it's hard for me in the gym especially especially when I'm trying to do this other thing and then I see this guy doing this I got a little bit jealous oh I can do that and I can't do that mm, that kind of sucks right it's like no I want to start committing I want to start doing this more but that's not great because I'm trying to do this thing and seeing these people do this kind of makes me want to switch and that's not good for me because I'm trying to do this so it's also kind of like conflicting it's kind of bring me back to that thing of do I want to work out or do I want a free one which is basically why I stopped working out because I decided I want more I want to be more active than to be bigger I forgot what it feels like to be passionate about free running because now I just do it because my friends are like let's go let's go do some tricks it's just part of my life now but it's not really a passion. I forgot why I fell in love with the sport. And let me show you. Actually, let me tell you what I really love about the sport, right? Let me take you back. I'm here at the Parliament Gardens and I don't know, I think it closes in 30 minutes. We'll see what I can do today. The Parliament Gardens is completely closed for like three months or so. I'm gonna hate that. I'm not coming back here. It's gonna suck. This right here. This. This is what I fell in love with. Just the wall. I mean, maybe it's because I started with parkour, but I just love wall tricks. Let's see what we can do. And so that this doesn't sound too sentimental, I'm gonna be trying out shoes, different type of shoes. This one, I'm gonna try out this one, and a blue one in the car. I was gonna bring my Vans as well, which is my favorite shoes to trick with, but we'll see.
wasn't great. Okay, now I'm going to try it from the other side. That was almost a bad bail. That was so bad. I'm not the right. I'm left. Oh, I'm not left. I'm right. <laughs> so I slipped like I was expecting to. See those two buildings over there? One day I'm gonna jump that. Ever since I started going to the gym, everything feels so safe. I want to practice more, I want to improve my moves, but that's not what I've been doing in the gym. All I've been doing is just chilling, you know. You know, if I was a gymnast, no problem, man. The gym would be where it's at, because that's where the competitions happen, that's where everything goes down. But I'm not a gymnast, that's not what I do. Ever since I was very young, I always used to love climbing trees, used to love climbing walls, used to love chilling on the roof. As long as there's a wall or a tree, I would climb it, which is why I don't like going to the gym anymore. Everything just feels so safe. You can't hurt yourself when you try something. No risk, no anything. And that's not why I started doing this. This is not why I started doing parkour. I did it because of the rush and because I loved it. So I've decided to stop holding on to what's safe and stop forcing things because they're familiar. Instead, just risk it.